Hi, I am Dr. Sai Prasad Sahu, working at uh, BR Life Calling Hospital as consultant nephrologist. I am going to tell about kidney transplantations, its uh, myths and reality. Kidney transplantation is a major event uh, in recent times, uh, not very recent, uh, but uh, over the uh, over the last uh, three decades maybe uh, in the field of nephrology, where there was no hope, now has come up with. Uh, a lot of promises of having a near normal life. Near normal life, I mean to say it is at least like 95% of normalcy in a system where both the kidneys, one organ system is completely damaged and you come out of it successfully leading your productive life. Uh, there are so many myths about it, whether it is feasible, whether it is available, whether it is possible to go for a kidney transplantation when both the kidneys are failed people who is in failure in misery and uh, usually do not find hope at least and uh, the purpose of my saying is to clear up that uh, when kidneys fail both the kidneys fail uh, then it is detected usually detected very late in the course of the disease when the disease is symptomatic usually 80, 80 to 85% of both the kidneys are gone. Then it is not possible to prevent a complete renal failure. So we will not worry about that much because we can't do anything about that. There are no means available to revive a failing kidney. If it is a chronic kidney disease, if it is acute, there are ways to revive it. But most of the time it is chronic kidney disease and it goes into complete renal failure when it fails completely, when it is symptomatic, when the residual kidney is not able to carry life, then we need a renal replacement therapy. The replacements are, one is dialysis, another is transplantation. Dialysis versus transplantation should be clear in the mind of a patient and the family. Dialysis versus transplantation, if we consider the problems uh, and outcomes, then uh, the financial part, the pain of the therapy, the quality of life and the quantity of life, all the four parameters are better with renal transplantation. The cost of therapy is less, the pain of therapy is less, quality of life is more, one, uh, one can lead a productive life means he can complete his uh, com duties of life like carrying the family, carrying himself uh, is possible only through a renal transplantation with through a successful renal transplantation which is not possible through dialysis uh, then uh, the cost of therapy about uh, one and a half year of dialysis is equivalent to doing a transplantation in our setup in almost every setup so now about our hospital we are like Kalinga hospital has uh, been through the maximum number of transplantation in this state is the oldest institute and is a state of art institute in renal services, in renal transplantation especially. We do all ranges of renal transplantation, pediatry, the uh, smallest child was uh, 8 year old and uh, we do across blood group, ABO incompatible transplantation is also being done here and uh, regular transplantations are being done very regularly. Uh, outcome are not say 100% that is one again another uh, myth about transplantation that uh, if one person it will not be a hundred percent it is not hundred percent nothing is hundred percent the outcome is are uh, like 90 percent the result successful uh, of having a successful transplantation and uh, the common complications are rejection and infection which will keep on happening but in 10 to 12 percent of people that is the data for all over world and for our institute as well but there is chance that a successful renal transplantation will be there in 80, 80, 88 to 90 percent of patients that is a fair number because in dialysis having a successful life is like 30 percent at the end of three years 70 percent people will be either in misery or uh, will be dying by three years of dialysis having a successful life a normal kidney function 
at the end of five year is like 85 percent so there is no comparison between renal transplantation and dialysis uh, then cost factor cost factor is uh, it varies from institute to institute but uh, our hospital is doing trans renal transplantation at a package of 3.5 lakhs rest is uh, like avo incompatible transplantation swapping in case of incompatible blood groups they all are being possible here and uh, we are doing it uh, i i try to cover the myths and reality the feasibility possibility and uh, uh, even negatives of both dialysis and transplantation the message i need to give uh, give it cl uh, clearly into th the society is that do not hesitate to ask at least uh, whether i can have a better life whether i can live completely whether i can be able to carry my responsibilities the answer is renal transplantation at least dare to ask dare to think so that you will come out of it and come out completely thank you